I'm here with Haley, who is an instructor in Platinum Pilates. Haley, what exactly is Pink Ribbon Pilates? Okay, so Pink Ribbon Pilates is a style of Pilates which was founded down in 2004 by a lady called Doreen in the US. Um, Doreen not only founded the Pink Ribbon program, but she also is a survivor of breast cancer herself. Um, so she's very passionate about getting people back to living and not just surviving, getting healthy movement back into the body and getting women regaining not only their confidence but full mobility back into the affected area. Are there mental and emotional benefits to it as well? Yes, absolutely. In fact, I think that's the most important part of doing Pink Ribbon Pilates. And what I admire so much about Catherine and all my clients is that they don't let breast cancer define them. They are not a victim of breast cancer. They are who they are, and this is just nothing but a minor speed bump in their journey of life. So coming in here can just help them through that difficult time. Coming in here can get you relaxing more, get you focusing on positive things, get you more confident in your body. Gosh, Catherine, um, I'd say that's a bit harder than it looks. It definitely is. It, um, it took me at least, I think, five or six sessions to even get comfortable with those movements. They don't look tired when you see them like played out, but they actually are very tough, especially in the area where I was trying to work on. You've had your operation quite, quite recently. I had it in the middle of August. And how quickly did you come back to class after your operation? I think it was around six weeks. I could have come back sooner, I think myself, even after four weeks, but um, I just, to be safe, I, I just said I'd wait the full six weeks. What was the most challenging part of your diagnosis? I think the most challenging part was definitely what I thought people saw me as after my diagnosis. You don't actually feel that ill. You have a few days during the chemo that you're sick, but besides that, you're still the same person. You still have to go to the shops, you still have to look after the kids, and I just, it wasn't as bad as originally I thought when I first got diagnosed. It's not like in the movies where you're sick every day. You have a few days of not feeling great, uh, and then you just get on the other days. And that's why I was happy to come and do a class, just to make me feel like myself again. Gillian, um, you also do Pilates, and you're also indeed a, a, a breast cancer survivor, but you're a lot longer down the road than Catherine. Yeah, that's correct. Um, I was diagnosed with breast cancer over 10 years ago and um, took up Pilates a number of years ago and I found that it's just very beneficial. I had all of my um, nodes removed from under my arm and obviously after the surgery then you feel very restricted in the movement that you can do and you're obviously quite nervous about how much you can move your arm and what tends to happen is and I've discussed this with Haley, is how patients actually hold themselves on the side where they've had the surgery um, so I just find the Pilates is excellent to build up your confidence within your body and to build your confidence on the side of your body where you've had the surgery. I have clients coming into me that might have had surgery years ago and very often they're the clients that need the attention the most because you go into what's called a protective posture where you know you something foreign has come into your body you've gone through a lot you've gone through surgery and you end up slightly hunching the body a little bit mm -hmm. to protect it and so over time that area gets very tight and very rigid and so if you've left it for a few years that's okay it might be a little bit tighter but that means no excuses you can come back we can stretch you out we can get you moving again that's the beauty of pink ribbon you can come before the diagnosis, you can come after, you can come during, it's for everyone.